Welcome. I thought you would like a nice close view of the Semic writing. I've just started my journey and I thought you might like to come along with me. A Semic writing, I've written white pen and black pen, words from a poetry book, I'm just letting it flow. The letters, it doesn't, you can miss words out and full stops and it's just a, it's just a flow of writing. And on here, I've written in white pen and made a background and stuck some of the flowers on. I made a little sticker as well. Safe journey, little post postcard. And then I thought, ooh, it's going to be nice for ATC backgrounds. So I, I did some more. There's the there's the background, and then that's when I put the little flower picture on it. So let's let's go ahead and do some ascemic writing together. Before I start that though, my page, so it can dry, I had a little experiment of doing some on the gel plate. Now I saw ages ago, I saw PM Artist Studio do this and I thought, hmm, and it went in the back of my mind and then I thought, oh yes, things lodge in, in our minds sometimes and then when the time's right, we can do that. So let me, this is a paint pen. I think you probably have to be careful what pens you use on your gel plate. So just check. This is a Posca acrylic paint pen. But so I'm just holding it loosely and I'm going to, I'm not copying anything. I'll just say a few things. I'm going to say breathe and relax. Take time out of your day. Just for you. Probably would have been good if I'd have pumped the pen before I did that. It's quite it could be quite faint, but we, we will go with it. Don't forget to pump your pen so it's a little bit more juicy. But we'll go, we'll let that dry completely. And at the end, I'll pull that and we'll see what it's like. <laughs> this is an architectural magazine, so it's got some some good lines in it. Some great pictures. But this is the one I've chosen. Lots of lines to write on and down here and I was going to make a postcard for my six but I just think this lady it's like a little fashion show isn't it and she's got a mop and a bucket I just the light is gorgeous but I just think oh this is going to make just such a gorgeous page so here she is in all her glory which bits do I want in? Yep, let's tear that page. Holding the pen very lightly and, and loosely. The Song of the Rose Bay Willow Herb Fairy On the breeze my fluff is blown So my airy seeds are sown where the earth is burnt and sad, I will come to make it glad. All forlorn and ruined places, all neglected empty spaces. I can cover, only think, with a mass of rosy pink. Burst then, seed pods, breezes blow, Far and wide, my seeds shall go. It's 
it's just like I think it, it's just like scribbly really but you can make yours your own you can flourish parts of the letters and swirl you will find as lovely Linda said to me you will find your own style have a go and that's what I did I'm looking for in my horticultural diary it's an old one I'm looking for a flower and here we are look at these I'm not quite sure what these are striped anemones oh how lovely how lovely and I cut one out as best I do because I'm not a great one for fussy cutting and I thought it would be gorgeous for her to have a flower in her bucket. Why not? Just bring a little bit of exotic to her life. Cut that like that. And there we are. I'll glue it on. That's my take on Semic writing, but you have a go and I'm sure you're going to find your own way. And if you're writing on light, don't forget you can write in black pen too. Let's see if that Posca pen has dried and we can take a poll. Let's use this pink and orange again, shall we? Or shall we use orange and green this time? A little bit there. Oh, there's not much in this green. Let me have a look. Oh, yes, it's coming out. Now, what I have learned from Devon and PM Artist Studio is that you, when you do the pull, you don't need that much. So you want, if you brayer that off onto another piece of paper, and let's see if we can pull this up. Here we are. We have to let it dry actually. That's what I hear. This is what I hear these people with, with lots of experience say. Let's find another page and this is lovely. Lovely sort of ombre feel to it. Mm. That doesn't waste anything there. It just makes make a nice background. Hmm. Let's have a look. Oh yes. Here we are. Should we pull it off? Ooh, lovely. Oh, I'm pleased with that. Wonderful. Hmm. Mine is very scrawly, so you might find you might find a, a different way to do yours. I love it. Mm, brilliant. I'll make a lovely background and, and tear it up as well. Oh, brilliant. Let's spend. Oh, let's spend a little bit of time together, shall we? Oh, what else have I been up to this week? Well, oh, let me just have a sip of my tea. Mm. Oh, lovely. Slice of Victoria sponge, anyone? Mm, delicious. <laughs> mm. Mm. I've been playing in my wreck this journal again this week. 
you going? Yeah, I'm filming. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Nikki found me a little piece of rubbish along the way and I sh I thought I'd got put stick in here, but I haven't. Let me show you how I'm going to wreck this journal. Come and help me. Oh, I'm stuck to the tree though. <laughs> you got the one nail that I've chipped on. Oh, have I? Oh, <laughs> brilliant. I think it's doing it. Oh. It is actually. Well, we call that texture. Don't be Freddie. It has given it some texture. It has actually. <laughs> the tree's now got some texture to it. Yeah. <laughs> some colour even. Fantastic. <laughs> oh. There you go. It's kind of working. We love it. Mm. Isn't it? And we didn't get rained on. Oh, we didn't get rained on. This is not for you. I think it's looking amazing. I think it is actually. It's he thinks it's something it's to eat. <laughs> got my lovely Janet Burgess ATC card holder here. Let's open it up and take a lucky dip, shall we? Here we are. Oh, look. This is from Is um, Isabel in the Attic. Is it Isabel in the Attic? Abigail. Oh, what am I like? Abigail in the Attic. All the way up there in Canada. Oh, give you a close-up of this it's got mini it's got a mini button that says hello friend and a mini tag always love always 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 love oh it's beautiful Abigail thank you I shall pop it here to give me inspiration in the week thank you so much <laughs> Oh, lovely. The ones we've looked at, I'm going to put in in the pocket there. Wonderful. Oh, the three fairies over here are very busy. Flo, what is that on your desk? Oh, you are looking, all oh, looking so gorgeous by the flowers. You've got a clipboard. That's from Alicia, isn't it? That's going to come in really handy. She's going to be making lots of lists. <laughs> mm. Oh, and Primrose Hibiscus. Do you have a postcard? Oh. Oh, look at that. You've got a little stamp on it. Oh, and a little drawn bird. Oh, Michaelia. That is so sweet. <laughs> Oh, you're cherishing that, aren't you? How lovely. Hmm. Shall we light a candle? That would be nice. Oh, let's take a... Make sure we're sat comfortably and... Hmm, take a nice... Mm, deep breath. Oh, it wasn't until people put down in the comments uh, that Flo had that my bird, my bird brooch all along. What is she like? It was in her hat. I hadn't thought to look there. Hmm. You are not alone. hope you get some moments to take a breath this week and also maybe to do a little creating. Take care everyone from Freddie and myself. <laughs> Bye. sat here in the afternoons doing a little bit of crocheting and
adding stitches to the little birds. They're just so gentle to sit and add more and more stitches to. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Ready, smile. <laughs> Nikki taking a picture of the tree. <laughs> We're just stopping, you know, like they say, stop and smell the roses. And you were right, that is a stunning tree. It reminds That's you like of a family tree. That's so many different branches to it, it. Oh, isn't it? It's a large family. <laughs> it reminds me family. of like an um under the sea sort of creature. Yeah. Mm. It doesn't use two big googly eyes. <laughs> it does, and that's the hair. And that's the hair. <laughs> Is that you on a bad hair day? <laughs> yes, oh, I'm just really. saying. An American hornbeam? Uh, well, or European? European We're not sure. Yeah, but then that's just pull it up as an American hornbeam, but it definitely seems to suggest it's a hornbeam. 